This channel is making five thousand dollars a month. YouTube automation. YouTube automation. YouTube automation. YouTube automation with AI. Is it really that easy to start a YouTube automation channel? Let's find out. So in today's video, we're gonna run this quick experiment, and I'm going to start a YouTube channel that primarily consists of faceless AI videos, and we're gonna see if this side hustle is as easy as everyone claims. I hope you're excited because I am. Now there are so many different types of YouTube faceless automation types of videos out there, but I noticed that one of the easiest ones to start is probably going to be those relaxing meditation videos. One thing I noticed though while I was doing research is that meditation is a very saturated niche on YouTube. And what do we do in these situations? We're going to niche down even more. I just opened ChatGPT and I'm pretty much going to type in something simple like 10 meditation video niches that are not too saturated on YouTube. And within a few seconds, we have some ideas here. One of the suggestions that came out is nature sound meditations. So let's type it in. Okay, looks like competition is very high so I'm not going to go with this one. Another niche that I found is walking meditation. So according to vidIQ, this could actually be a good niche with a relatively lower volume and pretty low competition. So let's go with this one. All right, now that we have figured out our niche, we're gonna go to Filmora AI and I'm actually going to start the timer right now to see how long it's gonna take me to create a full-on high-quality AI video. So let's get started. So I wanna start with the AI text to video function, which is actually a really cool feature. Pretty much you can type in the text and Filmora will create a video based off of your text. Now you can write your own script or Filmora actually has a generated by AI feature, which will create the script for you. There are different types of text that you can choose from. I'm just gonna do other, and I'm gonna title this the same way as I would title a video. I'm gonna say 10 minute walking meditation for beginners. And here is what it came up with, which definitely looks like a guided meditation script to me. Now we're going to pick the voice that is going to be narrating the videos. So I know one of the biggest frustrations for people with AI generated videos is the very generic AI voice. Seems like everybody sounds like Siri these days. So I wanted to get a little bit creative with the AI generated voices. And that's when I remember that a lot of you guys have been commenting on my videos telling me that when you listen to my voice, it just puts you to sleep, which I'm still trying to figure out whether it's a compliment or an insult. But I guess in this specific situation, I'm gonna take it as a compliment. So Filmora actually has a very cool function called clone voice and pretty much all you need to do is to record your own voice while reading this script that they give you. One day, a monkey rides his bike near the river. This time, he sees a lion under a tree. Then, three of them become good friends. I think I'm gonna audition to be one of those audible readers now. Just kidding. All right, we're gonna hit clone voice. Life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. Okay, I don't know about you guys, but I think it sounds like me, like much calmer version of me, but it sounds like me. I'm gonna hit text to video and... Okay, I'm pretty nervous. A few moments later. One of the simplest ways to begin a mindfulness practice is with a 10 minute walking meditation. Find a quiet and peaceful place to walk, free from distractions. Okay, I think this is actually not that bad. Minus I'd probably say like the B-roll footage or like all the stock footage. This is one of the things that I noticed, like obviously for AI, it's still a little bit hard to like get all of the right footage, especially when it comes to like meditation videos. However, the cool thing about meditation videos and the reason why I really like them is that, you know, like nobody really cares about the visuals because you are mostly like, either have your eyes closed or you're just walking. And I still do think that you need to put in some some effort with these AI videos because I'm noticing a lot of people just completely outsource the content creation process to AI and that's literally how we end up with like so many crappy AI videos that just totally like you can tell they just all got thrown in together by AI but we're gonna put a little bit of effort into this video. I am going to completely remove the subtitles which by the way it is pretty cool that they generate subtitles for you automatically but yeah I'm going to remove all of the footage and the subtitles and for meditation videos sometimes you literally just need either like stock footage or honestly just like a still picture which I actually really like that idea because Filmora actually has an AI image generator which we are going to be testing today so I'm going to put something like snowy mountains in the Pacific Northwest it's like a million degrees in Las Vegas right now so I'm just craving something like that so that's what I'm gonna do all right let's hit generate a few moments later 
And this is what we ended up with, which I don't know about you guys, but I think this is really cool. This is exactly what I had in mind. And I think we decided on a 10 minute guided meditation, which, or, you know, obviously you can make it a lot longer. But for now, I'm just going to drag this picture out until we hit that 10 minute mark. Okay, cool. Obviously, like the main struggle right now is that we don't really have enough kind of like the actual guided part to stretch the whole 10 minutes. However, as somebody who does a lot of meditations, I can tell you like even with guided meditations, you don't actually want somebody to be talking for the whole 10 minutes because that defeats the purpose. So pretty much what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and space these out. Obviously, we have to make sure that the script still makes sense. It's a great walking meditation. Okay, I got these pieces spaced out a little bit. Now there's kind of narration happening all throughout the video, but not like all at once. Now let's talk about the music parts. So I do like this music overall, but I think we can do a little bit better. So Filmora actually has an AI music feature, which is really cool. I've actually never tried doing AI music before, so we're gonna test this one together. So here's what I'm gonna do. It's going to ask you about the mood, the theme, and the genre. The genre. Genre? Genre. It's a genre. For mood, I actually want something, let's say you can do happy, sad, epic, sentimental, but I actually want to do peaceful. So let's go with peaceful. In terms of the theme, I'll go with nature, since like this picture is really inspiring me right now. And then the genre is going to be, oh, ambient. Let's click generate. Okay, let's hear it. Okay, I feel pretty relaxed already. Okay, I kind of like this. What about this one? Okay, this one is definitely a little bit more like lively. Oh, it's like moody. Okay, I like both of them, but I would say like for the mood of this video, I kind of like the first one more. We're gonna go and drag it down here. Now, I know we only have about a minute and a half of the music track, but we're just gonna use the oldest trick in a book and we're just gonna copy and paste it until we hit that 10 minute mark. I bet nobody's even gonna notice. All right, and that is pretty much it. Let's see what we ended up with. Find a quiet and peaceful place to walk free from distractions. Begin by taking a few deep breaths to center yourself before starting your walk. And obviously I'm going to include the link to the full video, but I do think this one actually ended up pretty good. So if you like my voice and you wanna see more faceless YouTube videos with my voice and meditate to my voice, you can check out that channel. Okay, now in terms of timing, looks like it took me about 17 minutes from the beginning to end. And that is also including the fact that I had to like talk to the camera and explain the whole process at the same time. I do feel like it would just take a little bit less if I didn't have to do that. But all in all, this is not a lot of time at all. Just in comparison, obviously all depends on niche, but typically for me to produce a 10 minute video on my channel, it takes days and days to produce literally a 10 minute video as well. So I don't know about you guys, but to me, this seems like a very low maintenance, which is also why I really like this meditation niche, even though it is very saturated. But as we already talked about, if you really niche down, you can make a lot of things work. And now let's finally talk about creating the actual faceless YouTube channel. So I play around with a lot of different ideas of what I'm going to name it. And I came up with like the most creative name ever, and I'm going to name it the Cozy Channel. I know, super creative, but I feel like it's just perfectly reflects everything and it is a pretty searchable name especially when you want to like search something like cozy videos and things like that so in order to create the banner for this channel i'm actually going to use one of the images that fulmora generated for me i'm going to upload it on this channel we can add text but i think i just want to keep it simple like this now in terms of the profile picture, I'm also going to use one of the Filmora generated photos and I'm just going to put, I guess, like the word cozy right here. I'm literally just going to go ahead and screenshot this. And this is the final product. I don't know about you guys, but this looks pretty cute to me. And then we are going to go to the Cozy channel and then start uploading these videos. One of the things that I was really impressed with is I really feel like I was able to complete everything just inside of uh, Filmora. Instead of going to like so many different platforms as software, like a lot of these YouTube automation videos are teaching you to do. I'm also super grateful that they decided to partner with me in this video. So if you are interested in testing Filmora, 
Nakamura. I will include the link down below, so feel free to check it out. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I think you're going to like this one as well, so make sure to check it out. And as always, I release new videos every week, so make sure to subscribe for more videos about side hustles, passive income, and making money online. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!